Hey, Shalom, we the Hebrew Israelites. Coming to you another weekend. Come preach this gospel. All praise to Howard Bashimi. I was shot double honest to the elders of GMS. The real world. Honest to out you, all you brothers out there teaching the truth and sincerity for the love of your Howard Bashimi. I was shot. Psalms 94 and 14. For the Lord will cast off his people. Neither read, read that over from the top. Uh, 94 and 14. For the Lord will not cast off his people. Okay, the Lord will not cast off his people, you know, because the Lord has an elect, a chosen people. Those people are not gonna get cast off. Okay? Go ahead, read. Neither will he forsake his inheritance. But judge shall return unto the righteous. Judgment. But ju uh, yeah, come. But judgment shall return unto the righteous. The Lord, the Lord has an inheritance. Those, his inheritance is the elect, the, the 144,000 and the one third. You know, he has he has an elect of, of, of all of all the children of Israel. Those that are chosen to come out here and do this work. You know, all okay. that and, and all. And all the upright in the heart shall follow it. Who all, are, the, all the upright in heart shall follow it. Go ahead. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? The Lord, the Lord is asking the question. He said, who's going to rise up for me against the evildoers? You know? Because, you know, the Lord, is, the Lord has done so much for us, so many great things for us, you know? By, by, by looking out for us, giving us a roof over our head, you know, giving us clothes on our backs, you know, give, giving us giving us the, the uh, opportunity to learn this truth, you know, keeping us from being sick and in the hospital on a respirator somewhere. Read that part over. Who will rise up for me against the evildoers? Who's going to rise up for the for him? You know, he's done. He's done. He's done innumerable things for us, even within within the past week. So the Lord is asking question. Really, the Lord shouldn't have to ask this question. But when you look at these people, our people, man, you, you see why he said that. So the Lord is saying, "Who's going to rise up for me against the evildoers?" You know, part of that rising up is being righteous. Because, you know, earlier in the scripture said, the righteous shall or he shall hear it. Go ahead. Or who will stand up for me against the workers of iniquity? Who's, who's going to stand up for the Lord against the workers of iniquity? Man? That's the Lord asking the question. He's not asking that. He's not asking that question to the two thirds. He's asking that question to, to, to the people that he's dealing with, man. The elect, man. Who's going to rise up for me against the evildoers, man? Haven't, haven't I done so much for you? Now, what are you going to do for me? And what's learning this, a, 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 a lot of you know, the learn, learning this word is not, it's, it's, like, it's not grievous. It may be, you may, it may be tedious, you know? But it's not grievous, man, to learn this word. Come on, do this work. It's not. That's not. It's, that's not a grievous thing, man. You know. Actually, once you get into it, once you get into it, it's. It's. You know. It's. It's an exciting thing. You know. It's exciting. You know. Because you. You're not just learning. You, you're not just learning knowledge. That's. That's. You know. You're not just learning things that can't benefit you. You know, like you can, you learn, you learn how to, you learn how to, um, you know, fly a plane, drive a car, but ain't gonna be no planes in the kingdom of heaven. So that then that may benefit you temporarily. You know, you can go to school, learn, learn, learn a skill, learn a trade. Yes, that's only to, to benefit you temporarily. You know, but this, this right here, this is what benefits you. To, uh, Right now, and in the and in the kingdom of heaven, and this this is the key, man. This is the only way to get there. Ain't no other way. Ain't no other way to get there. Come on. 
Also, man, it, working at Esau's Kingdom is, is, is laborious work, man. You get tired of fucking working, man, day in and day out, man. Your fucking bills are not met. Your fucking kids can't eat. You can't. I mean, it, even if you do work, you work to pay fucking bills, man. Mm -hmm. That's it. It's a fucking burden, man. Yep. So I mean, so you have to strive. Even even being a, even being Jake in this motherfucker, you got to try to strive three times as hard, not twice. Ten three times. to four. Maybe ten, ten times. Con, I can't. Ten times as hard, man. To to fucking make it, man. To get a fucking new car, man. If you got a penny in your ass job, you get a halfway decent car, man. You paying up the ass, man. Yeah, yeah. So the Lord said this, man. No, no, I, I want him to get that. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Ecclesiastes 6 and 19. Come unto her as one that plough and soweth. Mm -hmm. Wait for her good fruits, for thou shalt not toil much. Ah! Demons, man. Demons, man. Demons, man. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead, bro. Fucking demons. Fucking demons, bro. <laughs> Alright. Coming to her as one that plows and soweth. Wait. Her is talking about the wisdom of the yeah. You know, wisdom and understanding of, of the truth, man. As one that ploweth. You know? Cause this is this is the this is the work that you're supposed to take seriously. All this other work is just to get by. But this is the this is our job right here, man. Learning these trip, scriptures and I, and out of all the people on earth, all these niggas that don't want to know the Bible, all these niggas that keep walking past like yo, hey, uh, they teaching the Bible. It, uh, we need to run. You no know, people treat this Bible like it's a biological disease. Man. If I learn that, then I gotta be a lame and all this. But no, this is actually cool, man, because you're learning the truth, man. You know? I'm, I, I thank the Lord I ain't one of these fucking niggas out here, man. That's walking. And, and you know what? At any moment, the Lord could, could take me out of this truth, man. And that's the scary thing, man. At any moment, the Lord could take you, put you back out there in the world, man, make you a bugged out nigga. Without understanding, man. You know, that's the scary thing, man. That's why you gotta take this thing seriously. Go ahead, Reed. Yep, it says, um, come unto her as when that plow and soweth. Wait for her good fruits, for thou shalt not toil much in laboring about her, but thou shalt eat of her fruits right soon. Basically, you're gonna get to understand. They say you should eat from her fruits right soon. Which means what? You're gonna be able to teach, teach other man, all right? Is, this word is gonna benefit you, all right? It says, she is very unpleasant to the unlearned, and he that is and he that is without understanding will not remain with her. Yep, and the scriptures say she is very unpleasant to the unlearned. No, the scriptures say fools hate knowledge. Yep. You know, the scriptures say fools hate knowledge, man. Mm -hmm. You know, know why? Cause to, Cause to a nigga in the world, man, this is a cut, man, on, on their daily life. This is this is this is chipping away at they at they so-called uh, 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 daily living, which ain't living. You know, Marvin Gaye said the best, this ain't living. Go ahead, bro. He says, um, she will lie upon him as a mighty stone of trial. He will cast her, he will cast her from him ere to be long. For wisdom is according to her name, and she is not manifest unto many. She is not giving, man, that's, man, that's, that's beautiful, man. You know, it's, man, this is a, a privilege, man. Yep. This is an honor, man. To be around men and notice, and know these scriptures, man, that's, that's the only honor that you can receive on this side, man. To, to, to get into this word, man. To be coming to the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, man, that's honor. That's glory, man. And to and to to live, breathe, and to and be ready to die for this truth, man. That's an honor, man. All the rest of this fucking bullshit is folly, man. All the rest of it ain't nothing else out here, man. Ain't nothing else out here, but that martial law. <laughs> 
but the, uh, the uh, uh, what is it? The the uh, militarization of the police. Yep. And, and, a, and, a, and a gun butt upside your skull, man. Guillotines, man, and famine. Go ahead, bro. Say, give ear my son, receive my advice, and refuse not my counsel. And put and put thou feet into her fetters, and thou neck into her chain. Basically, you know, hey, you supposed to basically buckle down in this truth, man. You know? This this basically you were you a slave un, unto this, man. Mm -hmm. Alright? Because Paul said it caused affliction to my bonds. Yeah. Which means bondage, which yeah. is where bondage comes from, which is slavery, man. And Paul was learned in the truth. So like you, man. No, oh, you right. Paul was a learned man in the truth, though, man. That's why, and you know how, and just like the elders of GMS, man. From Elder Tahar, Elder, Elder Rakai, Elder Ramla, Elder Gabar on down, man. Elder uh, uh, Manatazak, Elder Tazadakba. You know, there's so many of them. You know, that we learn from, but you know, them elders are learned men. And the prophets, and they are the prophets coming back in this world today, man. Because they're the, they the only man that's, that's out here teaching this truth the way it's supposed to be taught. You, I don't even supposed to say it like that. They're the only man out here teaching the truth, period, man. There's only one way it's supposed to be taught. Is some more to that, yeah. bro? Yeah. It, it, it's mighty funny. Um, like all you damn scoffers, man, you, you saying, well, they don't got the truth, GMS don't got the truth. Well, guess what? You guys don't have no videos or nothing, man, you know? So so if you guys are, 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 are so so much uh, uh, authorities on, on the scriptures, why don't y'all show us how it's done, you know? Instead of being on the damn common board, since since y'all since y'all got the breakdowns, but y'all don't have no breakdown. That's why you on the on the elders page. Just really secretly you're learning from, from the elders. You you're scoffing and trying to learn at the same time, man. That's all you doing, man. You scoffers that want wisdom, man. You know, like the scriptures say many that's how that's how you know we're in the last days, because the scriptures say many scoffers shall come in the last days, man. That's how you know, hey, that's how you know this thing is close. A long time, but I've been here long enough to know that it's a lot more scoffers yeah. than it was yeah. when I first got in. And when it's talking about the last days, it's talking about the last days of this society. And this rulership of America, man. Yeah. That's what he's talking about. Yeah. These, these are the last days of this like society, man. Yeah. So, so you ain't you ain't gonna hey when, when that hey you ain't gonna have no 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 free pass in that day, man. Yeah. All that shit you niggas doing, making making comments on the comment boards and shit, man. Oh, you think the way you you think you think you're getting away with evil, man? It's gonna be manifest in that day, man. Yeah. Your your works is gonna be manifest, man, in the fire. Yeah. You receive for yeah. what you have done, man. <laughs> you know, hey, hey, you got some more? Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. Go ahead, bro. It says, it bitch. says, put thou feet in her fetters, and thou neck into her chain. See, you a slave to this truth, man. Bow down, thou shoulder, bear her. Be not grieved with her bonds. You see? Mm -hmm. Come unto her with thy whole heart and keep her ways with all thy power. Search and seek, and she shall be made known unto thee. When thou hast got hold of her, let her not go. For at thy last thou shalt find her rest, and thou, sh and thou shalt be turned to joy. Then shall her fetters be a strong defense. See, and, 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 and what is that talking about? Her fetters be a strong defense in the day of trouble. Cause it's like what? Wisdom and knowledge shall what? Be the stability in the day of thou times. Mm -hmm. So what? What it say? Her fetters shall be what? A strong defense, man. Yeah. Yeah. That's right, bro. All right. That's the truth. <laughs> it says, uh, yeah, uh, then shall her fetters be a strong defense for thee and her chains a robe of glory. A robe of glory, yeah. man. That's, that's why I said earlier, man, that's, this is glory, man. This, this, is the, this is glory. Being in the truth, man. Being, being, being immersed in the truth, man. Being around brothers that actually love you, man. You know? This, this is glory. You got that in Joshua? Yeah. 
Uh, this is Joshua is 24 and 14. Uh, therefore, uh, now, therefore, fear the Lord and serve him in sincerity. Fear the Lord and serve him in sincerity, man. And in truth. And in truth, man, the scriptures. Yeah. yeah. 24 and 14. Keep going. Yeah, go ahead. And put away the gods which your fathers served on the earth, other side of the flood. Yeah, the gods that your fathers served. It's, it's not just talking about deities, Buddha, and all of that. It's talking about the, the anything that you put before the Lord, man. It, it can become an idol. Anything can become an idol. Jordans can become an idol. It can, the man. The motherfuckers it's are funny. idol, man. No, no, no. I, it sounds funny. No, no, right. no, but no, it's, no. It's it, it are. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Come on, right. I got to test them. Because niggas kill each other over Jordans, man. Yeah. But 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 you won't but you won't kill a faggot, man. Which is according to the law. How many people you see? How many people you see running around just slaughtering faggots? But a nigga get gunned down for a pair of fucking Jordans, man. Yeah. Well, oh, oh, fucking get robbed for him, man. That's the fucking sense in that, man. Show you how backwards this world is, man. And, and no matter how many niggas get killed, Michael Jordan still gonna come out with that. Because, you know, all he cares is money. That's why the scriptures say the love of money is the root of all evil. Go ahead, me. All right. And put away the gods which your, which your fathers served on the other side of before, uh, of the flood mm -hmm. and in Egypt and okay. serve ye the Lord and serve the Lord man and him only go ahead all right and if and if it seem evil unto you and if it seem evil unto you to serve the Lord to serve the Lord choose if, you this this day the scriptures say if it seem evil unto you okay. to serve the Lord which I looked up the word evil and then you know the evil means uh burdensome no saddening, you know. If it seem, if it seem, if it seem, uh, uh, like like oppression to serve the Lord. No, read that over. Con, con. Yeah, I, I got a, I got a precept. No, hey, said. no, go ahead. Yeah. Read, read, read. No, read your precept. Okay, yeah. All right. This is Matthew eleven and twenty-eight. He said, "Come, come unto me, all ye that labor mm -hmm. and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest." This is your rest, man. Yeah. The scriptures. Yeah. The comforter. You know? This is your rest. Go ahead. Take my yoke upon you and learn of me. Take my yoke. That mean that mean come in, come 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 into this. Yeah. Come into this uh this bondage, right? Man. Be a prisoner of this. Yeah. Be a prisoner of this. You know Take, we already we already been in bondage all these years. Yeah. Under yeah. wicked, under wicked authorities. Right. So you should want to come in bondage under a righteous authority, which is the Lord. You know? He said, take my yoke upon you and learn of me. Learn of me. Yep. For I am meek and lowly in heart. And the Lord is meek and lowly because we should all be dead, right? For anybody that say the Lord ain't got no mercy, man, they need to go jump off the tallest building they can find. That's right. Because you can, you know, the Lord will allow, you can be a whore and the Lord will allow you to be a whore, man. Right. And he wink at it. Knowing the Lord don't just kill your kids, man, and have you out here. You know, hey, the Lord is long suffering. Hell, yeah, hell, yeah. oh, it's like Israel as a nation was a whore. Yeah, because they were whoring after other gods, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's the truth, bro. As, as as a whole nation, man, Israel went off to went off into other shit, and he, and there's plenty of examples in the, in the scriptures, man, how Israel went off into other gods, man. I got a it's, it's it's tons of examples in the scriptures, man, how Israel went off, man. And you still going off. Yep. yep. To this very day, man. You, you same Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, you still going off, man. Mm -hmm. Fucking um worshiping um Mary and fucking white Jesus, man. Yeah. Going to church on Sunday. You in the Egyptology. All that crap, man. You 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 in the Mother's Day, Father's Day, Christmas. Yep. Anything you can name. A, a nigga is gonna worship, man. When I say a nigga, I'm about you Latino, you Native Americans too. Not 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 not, not just the dark tribes, man. Especially you damn Latin tribes. Yep. Yeah. Sure. You all off, all off into that bullshit, man. Yep, man. Yeah, man. Like, hey, what's coming up? Fourth of July. Fourth of July. Yeah. Yep. Hey, you know what? Ain't, ain't a nigga around here listening to this truth. But Fourth of July, I bet you be streets and streets be full of niggas, man, oh, Lord, to celebrate evil. Yeah, that's it. 
That was just a cut last, like last, I think it was last year, a motherfucker in my neighborhood. Dude was a, dude, he just got a, he just got a new job. Making like 20 something dollars an hour. And on 4th of July, this nigga was throwing a fucking kid's party, 4th of July party. And the Lord allowed that nigga to blow his fucking left arm no, off. No, well, matter of fact, it, um, Lake, Lake Edna, matter of fact, this is um, when the brother Tobiah was, was, um, um, was um, okay. in the camp, you know? Man, that brother, he, he's still a brother, all right? Yep. Okay. All right, that brother, he's coming on back around. But anyways, uh, but the, uh, the, that, that brother, uh, we was at, uh, we was coming from one of them damn restaurants, man. You just seen Amalams flying to Lake, Lake Edna. It's a parking shit, man. And, and I'm like, damn, all them Amalams flying over there. And the next day, man, it was a newspaper, man. It's, it's a bridge they got over, over a damn little pond out there. The motherfucker collapsed, man. Kill, kill like 20 people, man. <laughs> right. hey, and Lake Adam, man. It's right. deep, man. man. Most high killed they ass on 4th of July, man. And this right. is some motherfuckers gonna die this 4th of July, yeah. man. God. A lot of yeah. motherfuckers gonna die, man. We in the time of judgment, man, where people just gonna be gonna be getting put to death. Left and right, man. God. God. Don't, 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 don't be surprised if, hey, man, it'd be a terrorist attack on the 4th of July, man. God, don't be surprised. Yeah. What about that, man? On your Independence Day. Hey, Independence, that's a joke. Yeah. Why not even your fucking Independence? <laughs> you know, Go ahead, I got a precept uh, in Judges. <laughs> Judges 10 and 13. Yet ye have forsaken me and serve other gods. Therefore, I will deliver you no more. Go and cry unto the gods which ye have chosen. Yeah. Let them deliver you in the time of your tribulation. Yeah, yeah, let them right. motherfuckers stand up, man. Right, what they yeah. not going to do, man? That's right. that's right. Let them crickets chirp, man. That's, what's, that's exactly what's gonna happen. You waiting on them other gods. The, the crickets gonna come before they do. And chirp and laugh at your ass, man, to death. You know, the, hey man, hey, you can't imagine, I can't imagine how much that pissed the Lord off, man. Yeah. You know, for, for, for him to create you and then you go out and serve another fucking white guy, man. It's a the, cracker. It's the same thing as if your son, you raise you up your son, in this in this world, and you give him the truth, and you trying your best to grill him up, and then he 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 uh, ventures off into some old bullshit, man. So how you think the Lord feels, man? Yeah. That's just like you raise your son to be an NBA player, and he fucking run off and be a fucking faggot, and just piss his career down the river. I'm just using a a, a a world analogy of just saying how much you would you be pissed off? You to nurture this boy up, and he's good, and he's fuck around, Dad. I'm not gonna play NBA. I'm gonna be a faggot. That yeah. will fucking piss you off, man. Yeah. Or you raise your son up to, to, to be in his truth, man. Come on. But brothers too, man. Come. Hey, man. Hey, another thing, brothers. The, the kids go off and beat yeah. their ass, man. Yeah. This is the scriptures. Yeah. Whoop their motherfucking ass, man. Oh, but <laughs> it'll save you a lot of trouble, man. And yeah. Jake conform to that, man. I know fucking women tell me, I'm not going to whoop them. I'm going to give them time out. Bitch, what the fuck is you talking about? And a fucking nigga is right there okay, okay in that shit. Hey, I got, I got scripture. This is uh, Jeremiah 8 and 12. Were they ashamed when they had committed an abomination? No. Nay, <laughs> they were not at all ashamed. Neither Shoot could they blush. Yeah, yeah. Therefore, they shall fall among them that fall. These niggas ain't ashamed, man. These niggas, man, smoking and shit. You think they're ashamed that they smoke? You know? These niggas eating pork. They ain't ashamed. Even though it's written in the Bible, a nigga make up excuse. I can eat pork. The Lord said all things are good. No, the Lord said don't eat fucking swine, man. But you could, hey, a nigga don't want to hear nothing let, until the Lord start killing people. Then everybody want to get religious. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Holla, then the hallelujahs come out. Yeah, man. Yeah. Yeah. us, man. Fuck you, nigga. All right, this last part, this last Who's part. Ah, oh, boy. Mm -hmm. uh, were they ashamed when they had committed an abomination? Nay, they were not at all ashamed, neither could they blush. Therefore, they shall fall among them that fall. In the time of their visitation, they shall be cast down, saith the Lord. Yep, they're going to be cast down, man. You know, because all these people say they believe in the Lord, but they see somebody out here reading the scriptures. Now, I got a blunt to smoke at the house. I'm going to, hey, man, I can't wait till the Lord start killing you niggas out here, man. When the Lord start putting you to death, man. Go ahead, bro. Yeah, that was, that was it today.
Hey, man. Right. Hey, hey, for, oh. Yeah, I'm afraid to say, all right. Yeah. For my yoke is easy. He said, for ye shall find rest unto your souls. Mm -hmm. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Yeah, man, the yoke of the man, the Lord's yoke is easy, man. That's right. How, how long did it take to read, read a few chapters? How, how, how far is it to call somebody and get understanding? We got a network. This is a network. This brotherhood is a network. Hey, man, how easy it is for you to go outside, man. Yeah. And teach, Azar. Yeah, you know man. about that, man? Especially when it's... Man, no, I don't even want to say that because they all old. They said fair weather. You know, but today is a nice day, man. God. But if it was if it was 20 below zero, we'd still be out here, man. Yeah. That's right. All right, bro. Uh, chapter 4. Uh, uh, no, no, 15. Joshua, Joshua 24 and verse 15. He said, and if it seem evil to you to serve the Lord. So, which a lot of niggas, it seem evil, man. They see us out here using using harsh language. Right. And it seem evil to you. You know? But the Lord said, the Lord said, I will not hear the speech of them that are puffed up with the power, man. For the kingdom of heaven is not a word, but in power. Choose you this day whom you will serve. Choose you this day who you may serve. Loose. Yep. So, hey, hey uh, uh, Jose. Yep. Choose you this day, man. That's right. Choose you this day whom you gonna serve, man. You know because hey, I'm telling you, every, every this it happens every time. I've That's seen right. this happen so many times yep. when people start when the Lord start jacking people up and killing people. Then everybody want to get religious. Everybody want to come out here and seek the Lord, man. Hey, you know what? And, that, and you know what? And another thing, man. I still like it. It's like it, it's heavy that he's saying that and he's bringing this out. Because I, I got to sit down, me and his brother did. I just created a new page. It's called GMS Edify. I haven't um, put it up yet. But that's basically what the lesson is about, man. On, on, on who you going to serve, man. And we bring and some of the scriptures, you know, have, have been pulled out. It was like, like fast scriptures that we pulled out, you know. And it's, it's the spirit, man. That's that's heavy, man. Yeah, man. We're in the last days, man. Yeah, nigga. And you said you was coming to camp this weekend, man. I said, I, I sat there and told you straight up. I said, don't say, don't say, because you you're not in the nothing. You're not in the truth enough to know to say, Lord willing. I mean, you're not in the truth at all. You know, yeah, you're not, you're not even seeking the Lord, he just, man. He just you just saying you're worshiping the Lord with your so, mouth, man. Matter of fact, I got a. Uh, I'm gonna bring something out after this, mm -hmm. but uh, you're seeking the Lord with your heart, man. With your, with your, with your mind, with your, with, with your mouth. Yeah. You're not, you don't know the scriptures, man. You're error. You don't even know the scriptures. You have to get the understanding, man. And I broke that scripture down to you. I said, look, man, how can you just sit and tell me I'm, I'm reading the scripture? You got to get understanding, man, from the man of the Lord, man. You know, you're not just gonna sit here and the Lord gonna deal with you like that. That's why I told you you shouldn't say nothing about coming to camp ahead of time, man. Cause Satan hears that shit, man. And you vulnerable to it. He's gonna let everything around, all type of shit is gonna happen around you, man, to keep yeah. you from coming there. Hey, hey, what happened to him last time he said he was gonna come and then Yeah, come? yeah, you went to, uh, 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 well, you had a show. Well, I understand, all right, but you had to pay your bills or whatever. But this weekend, you was like, man, I'm coming to count with y'all, I'm no, coming to count with y'all. The, the Lord killed his and boy. And then, right? then, yeah, then, then, again, again, death is around you. Now, the Lord smite, smite your boy, and you said the dude was a stand up dude, and like, just randomly, the Lord just, Pop that dude. Yeah, you might be next. You know, so hey man, yeah. hey man, we can't we, like I said, man, it's just like the world he sits, but the world the world he saying, you can lead a horse to water, but you can't make him drink it. You can lead it, you can show a nigga the, you can show a nigga the truth, but you can't make nobody get this, man. It's the Lord's program, man. Yeah, man. And the Lord tries to tries the heart. Get it, uh, hey man, hey, it, it's, it's written in the book of Samuel, the Lord killeth and maketh alive. God. He bringeth down to the grave and he bringeth up, man. Alright? So it ain't nothing for the Lord to kill you, man. All right? Ain't nothing for the Lord to smoke your ass, man. Yeah. Yeah, um, I got some. Second Chronicles 15 and 13. And that whosoever would not seek the Lord God of Israel mm -hmm. should be put to death. Should be put to death. Brothers. <laughs> brothers small what or small great. What is small? Well, you're a little baby. Yep. Or an old man. Yeah, man. Brother. Ooh. Whether man or woman. Ooh, that should be enough to shake your very bones, man. <laughs> <laughs> man, can you read that one more time, no, brother? Man, that's that's to the point, man. Yeah, that's, that's, that's cut, cut and dry, man. And yeah, it says, who shall not what? Wait, hold on. 
<laughs> Whosoever will not seek the Lord God of Israel will not seek the Lord shall be put to death. Shall be put to death. Whether small or great, whether small or great, whether woman, I mean whether man or woman, whether man or woman. Yeah. Man. You know. That's, hey, that's cut, plain, and dry. Hey, hey, can you finish that in Joshua? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, that's 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 what I'm 